Are you looking for a new place to shop? Well, I think you've just found that spot here in Greenville. I'm at the Market at the Point, and it's a new collaboration with Senior Action where you get to come and shop from different vendors. This is an exciting place. Andrea Smith, thank you so much for having us in today. Old friend of mine, uh, but we always love anything that supports Senior Action. Tell us about the market. It's going to be your, the shopper's new obsession. Oh my gosh, this is such a magical place. I mean, first of all, it's a market that includes 43 small businesses. So each one of the booths are individually owned and run and stocked and their personality comes through each one of them. And so you can shop almost 43 different stores in one place. If you think this is an antique store, it is not. Um, it is not a clothing store. It is not a you know one thing. It is a lot of things. So uh, we have everything from antiques to vintage. We have repurposed things. I love the story of repurposing items instead of just throwing them in the trash. Uh, we also have new items. We have everything from clothing, jewelry, apparel, um, gift ideas. And then probably one of my favorites is we have handmade items. And so we have artisans that have things that they have lovingly made uh, that they're selling too. So you can really find a lot of variety here. I know, because usually you would have to go to 43 different stores, stores. <laughs> to find 43 different vendors, and you, you, you don't support local as much. So this is the one-stop shop that you can actually support local vendors. So I love what you guys are, are, are doing here. And like you said, I've been walking around shooting video and everything from candles, jewelry, woodworking, uh, leather work from yes. Les Klein, which is a fantastic booth over there. So lots of different things for people to shop from. Uh, tell us, you guys are open now, and you have a big grand opening event coming up. Too. That's true. We, we opened February the 1st, but we do have new vendors that are coming in every day. So if you came that first week we were open, come back, because there's a lot of new people coming. And also, our vendors are changing out their merchandise constantly. As they sell things, they come in and replace. And so this is one of those places you need to come often, and because it, it will change dramatically from one week to the next. But we do have a grand opening. It's coming up April the 20th. We're really excited about that. So um, we'll have lots of fun things planned for grand opening. And hopefully all of our new vendors will be in place by then. So you can see all the new people. And then there's another reason to feel great about shopping here outside of the local component. It benefits Senior Action. That's right. Talk a little bit about what Senior Action does and how this shop is going to help you guys do more of what you do in the sure. community. Senior Action is a nonprofit in Greenville that has been around really for over 55 years. We have provided programs for seniors that range from social opportunities and activities, fitness, wellness, fine arts. I mean, our goal and our mission is to keep people active, engaged with each other. We also do a lot of other services, like we serve meals every day, we uh, provide medical transportation, but all of that stuff is expensive. It's not a cost that we can pass on to the seniors uh, necessarily, so we do depend on the community to uh, help fund what we do. Um, this store was an idea, um, a creative idea to come up with some new ways to raise money. Um, uh, everybody is struggling in this economy right now, and. Uh, having to be more creative and more um, adventurous about how we raise money. And so that, that was the, the idea behind this store. Is it was a way that we could support local small businesses, but at the same time raise money to support the programs at Senior Action. Uh, we even have a component of this store where people can donate furniture. So if you're trying to downsize your home or you have an antique or some other piece that you just doesn't fit anymore, please consider donating it to us and we will sell it and use it for our, our services. I love that you guys do that. It's a great way for people doing that spring cleaning to say, I wonder if Senior Action can use this in their shop. So they, they can just drop by or do they need to give you a call? They do, they do need to call. Okay. And so that way we can be prepared to welcome them and greet them and have all the right equipment we need to have to unload or whatever or you can email us either way we'd love to have the donations and you guys are located in the old Tuesday morning location right, yeah yeah I love how in Greenville we always refer to things by where what was old yeah. but you know so if you're not an old if you're not an old <laughs> Greenville person if you're new to Greenville we are located at the corner of Howell Road and East North Street mm -hmm. um, it is an old shopping center that we have converted senior action is actually in the same shopping center mm -hmm. um, and uh, it's it's a great high bit high traffic uh, yeah. intersection but again, East North Street and Howell Road is the intersection in the old Tuesday morning space. <laughs> exactly. That's a, a southernism that will never go away. Everybody <laughs> talks about it that way. And uh, vendors that are watching this that may have something to sell, will there be openings for people to say, this is a great, like, uh, no pressure way to sell items. You don't have to worry about a brick and mortar of your own. You can kind of set up booths. True. I mean, these, this model is not necessarily an original idea. There are these kinds of stores all over the place. And, and they are a good place for people who are interested in selling because they don't have to have the staff, we, we, we do all those staff transactions and handle the taxes and all those things. Uh, unfortunately, we do have a waiting list. So, I mean, unfortunately for them, but great for us, yeah. we have a waiting list. So we do encourage people to apply online. Mm -hmm. uh, as we have an opening, we'll start working on that waiting list. And um, so uh, we'd love to have people, you know, again, our folks are, um, one of the things I have loved about this 
is the community that we have built with the vendors. Mm -hmm. um, they have just been a great group of people. They've just rolled in here and gotten to know each other really well. And we've had a lot of late nights working. I bet. And um, so it's been a lot of fun building that community too between the vendors. But anyway, when we have, do have openings, we will start looking on that wait list. So, so please apply. Yeah, so definitely if you're looking to sell some items, definitely get on that wait list. And it's, it's in demand, as we can see. Yeah. People are shopping here. So thank you for all that you do for Senior Action. And definitely come out and check out the market. Uh, give us the dates or the times that you guys are open throughout the week. We're open every day from 10 o'clock to 7. There so you go. And, and no excuses. There you go. <laughs> shop, shop, shop. And we'll put all the information about the market at our website, livingupstatesc.com.